Hey, Geo Nerds. Just a quick revisit of the, uh, the, um, uh, really the Nudgy and, uh, Banyo area of Brisbane from 1883. Banyo didn't exist back in those days, but someone asked me for a higher res, and I think we should do one. It's a fairly complex map, so I've zoomed us down to here, and, uh, You'll see the uh, Schultz's farm mark there, and Gray's farm, and Schultz Canal, and which is not there, of course, but Tufnell Road's there, Nudgy Road's there. It's all there. What I'm going to do in a second is just bring up a modern map. I've just turned the enhancer on. You can see that, eh? It's amazing. Um, yeah, so here comes a modern map of where we are in the real world today, and a lot of the roads are still exactly where they were. Of course, the canal's there now, and you've got the freeway and all the other stuff. But Tufnell Road, St Vincent's Road, the railway line, it's all exactly where it was. Nothing's moved. Strange that. The big thing is, look at all the infrastructure that's gone over where the freeway is, all those roads over there, all those farms, all those houses, all that food we used to grow, all gone. Anyway, I'm just going to bring up that uh, aerial photo of 1946, but I've actually... Uh, morphed a little so it actually fits the map probably so you can see exactly where it was um, you can see Gray's farm up there Schultz's farm again where the sugar cane and all the pineapples grew uh, you can see an American army base there because it's just after World War II and uh, yeah so the roads are there they're, I don't think they're bitumen by the look of them and I don't think there would have been a bitumen road on the north side of Brisbane then but anyway but look at all those crops it's a shame we've lost all that but anyway progress onwards and upwards Probably a lot less mosquitoes there now than there was then. Hard to say. Anyway, I promise I'll leave this subject alone now. Keep rocking. T-Rock's out.